I'm sold. I'm Soldano. <laughs> I'm testing out the Soldano pedal right here. That's supposed to simulate the Soldano SLO 100 amplifier that was very famous back in the late 80s and early 90s, and it's still famous today because it's an incredible amplifier used by guitarists such as Eric Clapton, Mark Knopfler, Warren Haynes, and Eddie Van Halen, and tons more. And there's so many videos on YouTube about it. And I just said, I need to buy this pedal. And there was a great deal happening at Soldano. And I got the pedal for under 200 bucks. I think that deal is done now. I think it was just at the end of May. So I'm gonna unbox this SLO pedal, Soldano pedal. It's supposedly the Soldano SLO 100 in a stomp box. I can't wait to play it. I'm gonna unbox it now, if I know how to. There we go. Uh oh, just dropped something. Ooh. Ooh. Here it is, folks. This is the first time I'm opening this, as you can see. It's so beautiful. So they make this in two versions they make it in white and they make it in purple. And it's got a lot of similar controls that you would find on the SLO 100 Super Lead Overdrive. This costs 1 20th the price of an SLO 100. This costs about $200. And you can get an SLO 100 for about $4,000. I had the Boss CE3 Chorus. Eric's chorus use in the 90s was very slight. It's a part of his sound that's important and it's slightly there. I think this pedal is discontinued. You can get a bunch of great choruses like this. There's also the Robert Keeley Dino My Piano Tri-Stereo Chorus available. And I might be picking that up too, who knows, to recreate this tone. This pedal is pretty good though. And very low rate, very low depth, as you can see. And I feel like I need to have a chorus on for this Soldano test, right? So I'm gonna put everything to 12 o'clock. All right, so let's click it on. Hey, we got a purple light. We're on. I should just make a disclaimer. This guitar that I'm playing has the modern iteration of the Clapton pickguard, which is the vintage noiseless pickups, the TBX control, which is the first tone control here, and then the second tone control is the mid boost. But I'm not using the mid boost at all. It's off. Okay. All right, so I imagine you want to hear what the amplifier sounds like without the Soldano pedal on. Let's hear it with the chorus off. I'm using a Hot Rod Deluxe. I'm running the clean channel. Everything is at noon, bass mid treble. I've got the presence on nine. And the reverb is on about three or four. My volume is at 10. Soldano pedal on. Everything is at noon. It might get loud, as they say.
That's everything at 12. I didn't even dial it in, folks. So on the side, there's a deep switch, which is supposed to bring in some sub frequencies. So let's play a chord with it off, with the deep switch off. Volumes on five. And now with the deep switch on. Deep switch off. Now with the deep switch on. All right, now let me turn on the chorus. That's without any tweaking, and that's with the amp set at 12, pretty much. The bass, mid, treble, everything is set at 12. With some tweaking, I think that we can definitely get close to that sound. Let's, let's adjust the bass. Bass is at two. sold. I'm sold on <laughs> That's what the uh, slogan should be. Wow. Obviously, the reason I got this pedal was to see if it sounded anything like 24 Nights, and I think that, like I said, with a little bit of tweaking, I can be pretty much there.
and uh, very happy with it. volume that I would normally have it at. Adding some chorus. faith for a second. I've got the Boss CE3 chorus on and the Soldano pedal and I'm on the middle pickup on here. <laughs> too distorted for that right now. Again, needs some more tweaking. I have everything at 12 o'clock on the Soldano pedal. All of my controls on the Fender Hot Rod Deluxe are at 12 o'clock as well, bass mid treble, except presence is at about nine out of 12, I believe. <laughs>
I'm pretty happy with this thing. I haven't played those solos in a long time. I'm just playing them from memory. Obviously, I've been listening to them for a long time, but I think with a little tweaking, as I've mentioned, I think that we can definitely get the Clapton sound with a cleanish amp, with reverb, a Soldano pedal, and any Fender guitar. I think it's very possible. So I'll post a link to the Soldano pedal. You can get it anywhere. Amazon, Sweetwater, wherever you get your pedals, instruments. I'm really liking it. Good job, Soldano. And can't wait to dial this thing in anymore. And now with this pedal off, just clean sound right now. up the volume quite a bit. So we definitely need to level match to find what's appropriate. Let's see, what can I play us out with? Badge, right. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Go out. Well, actually, you don't have to go anywhere. You can order it online. Get the Soldano pedal. It comes in white or purple. I think it's a great addition to any guitar pedal board. I think that anyone trying to achieve that late 80s, early 90s Eric Clapton sound will be very happy with this. And this pedal into a clean amp with a little bit of reverb or a lot of reverb will sound great. Get the Soldano pedal. And let me know what you think.